In week four of his training for Bellator, we're here at the Des Moines Mixed Martial Arts Academy with Josh Neer as he undergoes a sparring session under the watchful eye of boxing coach Jeff Perez. I just take my boxers over to Milica just to, you know, get some sparring in and then I seen Josh, I seen some of his fights and I said, man, this, this is a bad dude, you know, so I asked Pat to you know, introduce me to him and asked him if he wanted to train with me. You know, uh, you just see the toughness and intensity in him, you know, tenacity, and that's what I seen in him, you know, and, and that's why I asked Pat, you know, I seen, I seen the way he did his, his hands technique a little bit, and I said, you know, maybe I can help him improve a little bit. I think the big thing bringing Jeff in helps motivate me, you know, it has someone there to push me. He's not going to let me sit down. Too yeah, wide. We'll work on it and throw it short. Just like that. Yeah. He's going to be there and say, no, you're not sitting out this one. You're, you're going you're gonna to go. You know, so he's a big motivator. And, uh, you know, just having someone there to teach me, too. Sparring has just ended. But the workout's not over yet. Now it's time for conditioning. As everyone else leaves the gym after conditioning, Nier and Perez hit the pads for three more rounds. Oh, uh, you know, having him there it helps me, you know, throw a lot more punches. And, uh, you know, he, he really concentrates when I'm sparring is to throw a lot of punches, you know, be the, be the first one to get off. I think lots of times I wait for them to come at me and Jeff always wants me to, you know, hit them first. Don't even let them get set. He wants me to get right in there and get after them. This guy that Josh is fighting, uh, he's a busy guy. He throws a lot of punches. He's really busy. And Josh is just going to have to get just as busy as he is. You know, he's going to have to pick up the pace more. And, you know, it's from what I've seen in his practices and that, that he's, he's doing that, you know. Push, push, come on. I think he's ahead of the game right now. I worked with him this morning. And then, uh, but after this seeing this workout today, I say he's ahead of the game right now. I think he's going to do nothing but, you know, improve, 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 and take care of business by day. What makes me know is if, like, I'm in really good shape and uh, I'm not getting tired, you know, when I'm going eight rounds. And uh, right now I am, so I know that I'm not peaking, you know. So here in hopefully the next four weeks, that's when I'll, I'll be peaking.